Hi friends, I'm back with one more video and today's topic is on how to do the calculations for profit and loss and break even for all the multiple option strategies like iron fly, iron counter, debit spread, straddle and strangle. So I've just given the formula for the maximum profit. Maximum profit is like net credit received. I've given the formula for max loss on the upper side, on the lower side, in line to that, how to get to the upper break even and also the lower break even. So rather than just giving the theoretical, I'll just take you to the Sensible tool. Okay, Sensible does provide you all the ready-made uh, option strategies. So I've selected Iron Butterfly, which is also called as the Iron Fly. You know, right? Iron Fly will have four legs. We get we, we sold two legs and we'll get two bot legs as part of the edging. Okay, so let's focus on how to derive to this maximum profit and how to derive this maximum loss and how to know what is the break even on the put side and what is the break even on the call side all right let me take you to this slide maximum profit it says net credit received okay see net credit received so if you look at the sold legs whenever we sell any options we end up getting the premium so we receive the premium of 66.5 as part of call leg and 57 as part of your p leg so the total premium received is let me receive the 66 dot 5 plus 57 right so this is almost like 123.5 is the total credit we have received so let me take a screenshot of this light so that it will be like easy for me to explain you all right i'll take the screenshot i'll just zoom it okay so now we got almost 123.5 as the total premium received i'll just make a note of it 123.5 all right and then along with this two soul legs we also end up paying some debit so these are the two debits we pay 13.9 and 10.9 so overall it would be like 23 dot nine so this is your total credit received and as part of two edges we paid 23.9 as the uh, premium so this is like debit paid so that's what i was trying to so this is what right net credit received is equal to total credit received minus total debit paid right total credit received is 123.5 and total uh, debit paid is 23.9 I'll deduct 23.9. We got the net premium as 99.6. Let me make a note. 99.6 as the total net premium received. Okay. So now let's see how we derived for uh, this 4980. I'll take you back to the PPT. It says net credit received let me pull my calculator so 99.6 is my total net credit received into number of lots so we bought only one lot yeah so i'll say into 50 4980 so this is the maximum profit this is what we were trying to do the calculation how to get to the maximum profit for the iron fly right 4980 how did we derived this loss of 5020 let me take you back to the ppt it says maximum loss on upper side it says call side spread minus net credit received into number of lots all right let me take you back to the sensible screenshot if you look at the call side we bought we sold 17800 and we bought a leg at 18000 uh, 17,800 was the sole leg and 18,000 was the bought leg. So what is the difference? So we have like 200 difference. All right. <clears throat> so the maximum loss on the upper side is like call side spread minus net credit. So the difference is 200. Let me get the calculator. The difference is 200. Okay. If you look at and the net credit received. Net credit received was 99.6 minus 
into number of lots. Number of lots is 50. So this is what 5020. This is the maximum loss on the upside. <clears throat> right? So your up your 5020 is your upside loss here. Yeah. And how do we derive at the put side? Same thing. Look at the spread. The spread between your bought leg and sold leg is 200. So 200 minus total premium received. Right? The same thing. 200 minus 99.6 into number of lots. So that we get your maximum loss on the downside. Right? So we were able to get the maximum profit and also we were able to do the calculation for the maximum loss for the iron fly. Now let's see, let's see how to get to this break even. Let me take you back to the PPT. Upper break even, it says call sell strike. Right? Call sell strike <clears throat> minus net credit received. This is your upper break even. The lower break even would be put sell strike minus credit received. Let me take you back to the. So <clears throat> this see, call side strike is 17,800. So 17,800 plus 99.6 will give you 17,899. Put side sell 17,800 minus this 99.6 will give you the <clears throat> put side break even. Let's test it. Okay. We'll take one example of uh, call site 17,800 plus 99.6, which is our premium. So that would give you 17,899, 17,899.6. It could be the other way, right? 17,800 minus 99 will give you 17,700.4. <clears throat> All right. So let me. All right, so let, let us take one more example. This time we'll take the example of short iron condor. This will have the same formula. Okay, this is your net credit received or the total net credit received is 13.9 plus 10, right? Almost like 23.9 minus 2.8, 2.8. So that will give you the total net credit received. So your profit would be spread you know the formula right spread minus same formula <clears throat> maximum profit would be a net credit received maximum loss on the upper side would be like call side spread minus the net credit into number of lots so this can be applied for even for your iron condo okay the same formula so let me take one more example of short straddle basically these have only two legs so this is like straight i mean uh, we do not have the buying legs for this straddle the maximum profit of 6175, you know, right? I mean, this would like become very easy for you because the total <coughs> uh, premium received is 66.5 plus 57. This is your total premium received as part of this two soul legs so into 50. This would give you a maximum profit of 6175. Just because we do not have any buying legs, maximum loss would be unlimited. Similar to that short strangle, right? Same thing. Your total premium would be 13.9 13 plus 23.9, right? 23.9 into lot is equal to 15 nifty. So 1195 would be your maximum profit with a potential of unlimited loss because we do not have any edge. Let me give you one more example of <clears throat> the bullish, the debit spread so this has slight variation the formula for the uh, maximum loss and maximum profit would be see if you if you look at the uh, maximum loss that would be like your debit paid so whenever we go for the debit spread it's 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 basically we end up getting like less premium and, and we pay like more uh, debit so if you look at the formula so we paid a debit of 66.5 uh, this one and we got a premium of 10 as part of selling this leg. That would be like 10. 56.5 is a total debit paid, right? 56.5 into number of lots would be 50. So 2825 would be your maximum loss. All right. 
to derive to this maximum profit what we have to do is like again take the spread of your bot leg and the sole leg so we have 200 gap okay <clears throat> 200 minus 56.5 into 50 7175 that would be your maximum profit all right so i think you know how to do the break even <clears throat> break even is right 18000 is your sold strike 18000 is your sold strike and the debit paid that is like almost 56.5 is this the correct <clears throat> we did something wrong here right so ideally we should have i've taken the wrong leg friends basically that is like 17,800 plus the difference the debit paid which is 56 dot 5 is equal to 17856.5 dot 5 dot 5 so I think we are pretty well covered <clears throat> like almost like uh, majority of the options trading strategies like iron fly, iron condor, debit spread, naked strangle, naked straddle. So I think this slide is very important. <clears throat> so without knowing the profit and loss, without knowing the break even, without knowing the potential max logs, it is like very difficult for us to do the trading. So, so always it's better to do some calculation uh, in the Excel or you can take help of Opstore sensible to the tool in terms of knowing your profit and loss break even and also the loss. Thank you friends. So I wanted to make short videos, but somehow it is getting extended. So next time I'll try to make it more short. So hope you all have enjoyed this video. Thank you. Thanks. For, thank you for watching this video.